We wanted to try and give everybody a chance uh, to play in the game tonight. They had all practiced very hard, uh, put a lot of time in. And if you get the opportunity when the first game comes, I like to try and give everybody a little taste uh, of what it's all about because they've earned it with their hard work. Uh, now we come back tomorrow night against uh, our team, Belarus, who we played twice last year. And we won one, lost one against them. We know they're a very good team. The coach does a very good job. Uh, they shoot a lot of threes. They shot 24 threes in the first game tonight. Uh, but uh, we'll have to come out, close out on the three-point line at the same time, keep them in front of us. Uh, but I thought overall I loved our spirit, and I thought we played very hard tonight. Well, you have different players. It's a different year. Uh, when you have uh, a changeover in personnel, uh, you try and find new people that bring a lot of energy uh, and that can pay attention to detail and listen to what's being worked on in practice every day. We have a lot of new faces that were not with us last year, but they've done a very good job. I don't know who the main people are because we've only played one exhibition game and four or five of our guys didn't even play tonight. Uh, so the key for us is to keep getting better, uh, work hard every day in practice. The players who are injured and did not play, we have to get them back. They have to get their conditioning back. And then we'll have some tough decisions uh, to make in the end when we can only keep 15 players. Самая главная победа и первая игра сборная, конечно, выиграть первую игру. Вообще не забываем всегда. Каждый новичок, думаю, хотя бы начать победу с победы, выступление за сборную. Если вы посмотрите, какие три очки забил, то есть это все было взаимодействие команды. Артур Доздов дал мне несколько пасов, свободные очки под кольцом сверху. То есть это все заслуга команды. У нас нет такого, что кто-то забивает и кто-то царь. Так все забивают, выигрывает команда. Это блок команды. В общем, ничего толком не менялось, просто старались играть. Намного сильнее хотели больше бороться, больше выигрывать подборы и играть в свою игру. Показывать кто что может, только первая игра, только начинаем пытаться как сыграться. Какие взаимоотношения внутри команды? Супер, отличные. Никогда даже не думал, что такое может быть. Все от самого старшего игрока до самого младшего. Я один из самых младших игроков, и ко мне такое же отношение, как, как к Артуру Дроздову. И Артур относится ко мне точно так же, как к любому другому игроку, это очень приятно. Uh, Ukrainian team surprised me. They are well organized, uh, many good young skilled kids, you know. They play well and uh, I think they're on way to make a good team, Ukraine. Our team, uh, we just got 24 hours uh, to, to come from Bucharest. We lost some baggages, uh, no shoes. Uh, but on the end, you know, I'm satisfied with the game, you know, I'm satisfied. But we lost on, uh, when we arrived to Kishinev, we lost uh, the baggage, you know, 11 players of so 15. It's mean, uh, nothing to change, no shoes, no jersey. You see, today, two Ukrainian team play. Tonight we'll receive, I think they will receive tonight our jersey, and tomorrow will be Romania against Israel. You know. Strong team, yeah, Israel is also a strong team. Okay. Well, okay, Romania know where is our position in Europe, you know, we are not top level team, you know, we try to push some young players and uh, we'll see, you know.